Hi everyone, it's Sadia. So for today's video, I'm going to share with you guys some things that I got from a $50 Poshmark mystery box. And um, if you want to know what I got and what my thoughts are, then keep on watching. So I basically ordered this off Poshmark. It came in like a USPS priority box and it was $50. And I'll link the closet um, in the description box below. And I got this like last Wednesday, but I had I really wanted to open it. And um, everything kind of came in this like cute little bag from Origins. So this is the bag, very cute. And so um, these are just some gifts that the seller gave. So these are really cute like butterfly earrings, really cute in like a holographic um, packaging, very cute. She also has like really pretty jewelry on her page as well. Um, some other stuff I got that were free were these cute little brushes. So this one, like a little eyeshadow brush. And this little cute little eyeliner brush. And it says, thank you for supporting my small business. So very cute. I really like the free gifts, those are really cute. All right, so um, the first thing I got was the Item Beauty uh, Ruled by Lip Gloss. It was really pretty. I did hear that um, their lip quip was really good. And so this is really cute. It's like pink. It has like cute little white sparkle to it. And then let me show you the doe foot applicator. It looks like that. Like that very very pretty and I have tried a couple of these things I did try this and it was actually really pretty on my lips um, however I think it looked a little light on my lips and it was a little bit too sparkly for me um, but I think this is really great for the value and this retailed for $18 all right um, the next thing was this Bite Beauty lipstick and it is in the shade Pluot and it's this really pretty mauve shade. I'm actually wearing this today. It's actually really, really pretty. And the seller asks you like, um, what are your, what are the lip colors that you tend to wear or what kind of eyeshadows or like highlighters. And so I told her I really liked highlighters and mauve lipsticks. So this is really, really pretty. I'm just gonna do a swatch for you guys. Very, very pretty, look at that. Really pretty. And it's like, it's not, it's not drying at all. It's very comfortable matte and it's not that transfer proof. So I do like this. All right, um, the third thing that I got was this Basic Beauty Translucent Setting Powder. Looks like that. And I don't want to open the packaging or anything, but basically like that, really pretty. And she does ask you kind of like your complexion and you know, I said that I'm like fair. And um, I haven't tried this, but um, yeah. All right, so those are three things. Um, the next thing, I mean, this was one of my favorite things. This is the Ciate London um, Watermelon Burst Hydrating Primer. I did hear a lot about this on like TikTok. I heard a lot about this from influencers. So I was really excited when I got this. Um, so when you take it out of the box, it looks like this, very pretty. And I did test this out and I actually really, really liked it. Like it's very hydrating on the skin. It's like a very thin, um, uh, serum so kind of like that very very pretty it's very smooth it's very it's, it feels really nice on the skin it, and it blends your skin out really well gives you that glow today so I really really like this all right so um, I have two more things so this is the beauty bakery palette it is their Milk and Honey palette. And let me open her up. I don't really have anything from Beauty Bakery. 
looks like that. It's a really cute palette. And oops, those are the shades. Very, very pretty. I'm just gonna do a few swatches for you guys. Um, do it on my other hand, actually. All right, so those are the couple of the swatches. They're super pretty, very pigmented. And so I'm really glad to get that. I know Beauty Bakery is like a high end too. All right, the last thing that I got was from Kenya on Tavuros Beauty Glow and Go Kit. So I've actually never heard of this brand, um, but that's how she looks like. Kind of looks like a really cute little diary or book. So that's very cute. And it does have a mirror. So those are the colors really pretty i mean i really like the layout of the palette it's actually a very pretty palette so let's do a couple swatch for you guys really quickly um let's swatch this independent shade oops and i'm gonna swatch this super pretty shimmer shade oh that is really pretty and all right so those are oops um it's a bit difficult to show you but those are some of the swatches i don't know if you guys can see i'm sorry but those are some of the swatches and um i mean honestly i think this is a really really pretty palette and i did test out some of the mattes and they seemed really creamy on the finger, but um, they don't last very long. So that was the only problem with that palette. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep reaching for it. All right, and um, she did send a thank you card and I think this has all the prices on it. So it said, thank you for purchasing a beauty mystery box from me. Listed below are the items in your mystery box and their retail value. So this item beauty lip gloss this was $16 retail value. The Bite Beauty lipstick, which is, where is, did I put that? Hmm, where did I put that? Put that back in the... Oh, sorry guys, I forgot a product. She also gave me the Natasha Denona eyeliner and it's this really pretty purple shade. Sorry, I totally forgot. Um, hmm. Where did that bite beauty uh, lipstick go? Hmm. Sorry guys, I can't find it. I, oh, here it is. It's like right in front of me. But this bite beauty lipstick, it was $28. So I think, and um, the Ciate London Watermelon Primer, this was $28, so already that's more than $50 that paid for the box, basically, those three products. And then um, the Kenya Ontiveros Beauty Glow and Go Kit, that was $48, so that's actually a lot for this palette. Um, not sure if that's worth $48, but okay. The Beauty Bakery palette, um, this was $38, and the... Basic Beauty um, translucent powder was $26, and the eyeliner was $24, and the brushes and this was about, this was free. So I think already it was way more than double the value the seller promised, about $175 of value, and I'm pretty sure it exceeded more than that. And um, I'll definitely have all the values in the description box below. And um, yeah, so overall, I think this box was pretty good. Um, you know, uh, the item gloss, the uh, primer, the Bite Beauty, uh, the Natasha Denona eyeliner. Um, these are kind of all like high-end products that you can find in Sephora. 
um, I think this was in an Ipsy box and I believe this is also in like an Ipsy box or BoxyCharm and this was also in a BoxyCharm. So these two things I think you can find in a BoxyCharm. Um, but honestly, I think that the value is definitely there. I think I paid, you know, I think I paid a good amount for this box. I think this is a really great value and I'm, I highly recommend this seller. So that's this video. If you like this video, please um, click that subscribe button and, keep, and uh, give a comment. And um, have a great day and stay beautiful.